Now let's get back to Cancellara. This is unbelievable. Fabian Cancellara. Fabian, fabulous Cancellara. Know the respect that every professional bike rider has for this man. One last shot at Olympic glory. This is huge, huge speed. Look at the difference. Fabian Cancellara, the Olympic gold medalist, four times the world time trial champion, and he's sprinting out of that corner just to get this race over and done with as Cancellara comes up towards that line. I don't think anybody's going to beat this. One, 12, 15, a minute and six seconds faster than anyone else. This is a very hard section of Cobbles airfield that goes slightly up. Gusev hasn't been able to stay in the wheel, and Cancellara now is getting what he needs. A lone attack now. Then almost a minute back to top goal, and the barrier's down. Well, the rules say you've got to stop. As he circles the velodrome, he will finish before anybody else enters. Now's a moment of pleasure. He can't believe it, but boy, does he deserve it. Fabian Cancellara wins Paris-Roubaix. Sitting up, he's almost Look putting the motorbikes into difficulty. They can't get around these corners as fast as he can, Phil. They don't realise how fast this man is going. That's okay, he's coming right up behind. That was the O'Grady Ben, but now he's sprinting after those bikes who almost got caught by this flyer from Switzerland. He's got to beat the time. Cancellara has put the icing on the cake for a brilliant London organisation today as he sprints towards the line to beat the nine-minute barrier. He beats it, he annihilated eight minutes and 50 seconds. No one left to do that. The Swiss fans out in force here to try and bay Fabian Cancellara up the Paderberg. He's managed to get him off his wheel at least, but I think Sagan's done enough up there. It's certainly taken its toll on the Slovak though. You just look at him there and Cancellara has made a difference there. Sagan's going backwards and Cancellara pulls away. And look at this, Fabian Cancellara. Thanks his lucky stars, Cancellara wins the Tour of Flanders for yet another time. And look at this, he's while he's digging very deep to hold on to the wheel of this machine. There's the attack, it comes up four kilometres to go, but a very quick reaction indeed. Getting up the banking, into the home straight now, it's going to go for the front, and set that mark has gone, and Cancelor is going to have to find something very, very special here, as we get mixed up with the chasers, but as they come up towards the line now, it's Cancellara comes over the top and he takes his third Paris-Roubaix and this one, bet your life, it will be his best. It's difficult to get traction, especially on this section, which is really, really steep. And as we see Cancellara uh, just, you know, turning up the gas here. Oh, and he is as well. That's fabulous. Oh, he just sits in the saddle and turns the pedal. Oh, what class. And Bonin's struggling. Bonin's struggling to hang up. That is super class. Fabulous ride by the Swiss national champion. He grabs a Swiss flag. Victory. 
goes to Fabian Cancellara. Right now, Fabian Cancellara is blowing through this field. Can he sustain this pace? Larson will hear the sound as Cancellara comes up behind him and watches he makes the pass. Wiggins caught and passed. Wiggins takes one look across to his left and sees Fabian Cancellara pass him. That's his two-minute man. But look at this, Fabian Cancellara coming up to the finish after clubbing the field. Look at this, so far from the finish, I've never seen this at the Worlds before. Cancellara has so much time to spare. And here is the push, and he's decided to light up. The afterburners are on, and I think he's done for Sagan. I think it's going to be between these guys, and still they roll. 300 meters and still nobody reaches out. This is absolutely remarkable. Van Arbeman, it's like a track race. Who's going to go? It's going to be Van Mark, surely. He staggers, he stalls, he tries to draw somebody else out. He doesn't want to give his wheel to Cancellara, and Cancellara goes for it. He's been there before. Van Arbeman goes for it for BMC. Cancellara comes through. Cancellara in the black, and the white hits the line, and it's going to be Fabian Cancellara. Responsibility, but Fabian Cancellara. Is I do the not believe this. The strength of the race leader has gone after them himself to save his yellow jersey from OJ. This is going to be a huge present. What a ride by Cancellara. He suddenly says he can win the stage for absolutely nowhere. They've wiped them out on the line of the stage of the Tour de France. 400 meters, 300 meters. Cancellara. The strong man of the time trial has ridden them off his wheel. McEwen and Robbie Hunter. Hunter now bowling on the left. Cancellara, Zabel's on Cancellara's wheel. And it looks as though we've got Cancellara, Zabel on the line. Napolitano, Bonin, they all got beaten by the yellow jersey. That'll serve them right. Bonin's attacked, and Bonin's attacked big style. He's forced Fabian Cancellara to close the gap. Oh, big attack by Fabian Cancellara. Now Bonin's getting the point, he has to shut this one down. Straight past goes Cancellara. Fabian Cancellara has just ridden away from everybody. That is absolutely incredible. Look at this man! This is super impressive. He's just hammering away at this now, Fabian Cancellara. This is one of the great finishes in Paris-Roubaix. And here the crowd! And another win here in Paris-Roubaix, four years after his first, it's his season, he is number one, Cancelar.